shocking discovery late at night in Benson. A mother and her three small children living in their car. Good evening, I'm Craig DeGrelli. And I'm Emily Zink. It started as a child neglect call and quickly became a much more desperate situation. Reporter Josh Egbert is near 64th in Maple with the story. Josh? Well, Emily, late last night, police say a neighbor called them of reports of children sleeping in a car. Their mother was kicked out of her boyfriend's house and then her mother's house and had nowhere to go. So she picked this neighborhood in sub freezing temperatures to stay. Martha Colburn was found sleeping inside her vehicle along with her three children late Tuesday night. A neighbor who called her in says she was kicked out of her boyfriend's house and then her mother's house. She ended up in Benson. When police arrived, the car was off and the temperature outside was a cold 25 degrees. The children were taken to Project Harmony. Police cited Colburn for child neglect. There's probably more to the story because there's always in, there's so much more than what we see or read sometimes, the complexity. Candace Gregory with the Lydia House says this type of situation is something they see far too often. Was there other reasons why the decision was made? And ultimately, I would say yes, that it wasn't a simple just case of someone in their car with their children. There's more to the story. Gregory says no one should have to sleep in their car because resources like the Lydia House are open 24 7. The open sign never closes. This is one of the overflow rooms. 21 mats cover the floor, giving those in need somewhere warm to stay. We are sleeping women and children on the floor on mats, um, and we have a 46% increase in homeless prevention in comparison to this time last year. Gregory says the need for a warm bed increases during the winter months. A lot of times police will bring those in need to the shelter, no matter what time of day. We have an awesome relationship with our law enforcement officers. They know that we are the place to the go to place for those women. Along with child neglect, Col Colburn will also be cited for possession of marijuana after police found less than an ounce inside of her electronic cigarette. We're live tonight near 64th and Maple. Josh Egbert, KMTV Action 3 News.